Good evening, everybody. I'm C.J. Ward. We begin tonight with a man who has reported on many presidential elections. Lou Cannon is a veteran White House and political reporter who also wrote Ronald Reagan's biography. He has plenty to say about this election, and News Channel 3's Tracy Lair spoke with Cannon tonight at his home in Summerlin. And Tracy, he shared some insights with you. He sure did, C.J. Lou Cannon has covered his share of elections, and he say there's no comparison to this one. We've never had a situation like this. As some people would say, Ronald Reagan, Ronald Reagan been governor of California for eight years, and California had a budget that was larger than all but, you know, a few nations of the world. I mean, uh, uh, we've never had anyone as inexperienced uh, uh, in government as Trump. Um, does that matter? Well, we're going to find out. Reagan biographer Lou Cannon says Democrats should stop blaming the FBI director and look in the mirror. I don't think there was a real appeal to the people who had voted for Bernie Sanders. Cannon says he understands the protests, but says Trump is going to be president, like it or not. She won the popular vote, but he won the election. And uh, we've had four other presidents who served who didn't win the, the popular vote, so that's not unique. Critics may not like Trump as a person, but they may be won over if he creates jobs by rebuilding roads and bridges, even if doing so runs a deficit. Well, this is an interesting time, and let's hope he does the, let's hope he, he has the, listens to the better angels of his nature, to use the Lincoln phrase. Cannon said that applications to immigrate to Canada have soared from 10,000 to 27,000 a day. Also, Canada's immigration website crashed on election night. In Santa Barbara, Tracy Lair, News Channel 3.